YouTube Thursday morning gonna head over to the brewery where I put the glycol chiller in last year we're gonna move that thing business is growing over there so we're gonna go pump it down cut it out we're gonna move it and do a reinstall of that thing so let's see if we can get some video of that I think it's Thursday morning I don't know what's today is the 24th maybe it's like 10 till 7 let's go get into this thing all right service valve on my compressor here and put the cap back on then we're gonna cut the lines and just get this thing removed a bit dusty in there okay This one. And we'll just go like this. Two, okay, let's do that. Okay, get your lines cut. Seal them up. Get them all taped up. Let's see if we can recycle some of that line set. Reuse it. Okay, so it's pumped down and it's cut away. Let's get this thing out of here. Okay, so we're gonna move the condensing unit over to here and the chiller tank in the back with the glycol. And then, uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to run the line set out like that and under and up, or I'm not haven't figured it out yet, but we'll get some video of this. Then the control panel is going to go on the wall right here. You can see the glycol lines are already ran. And then they go in the trench. Up and all the way across the building. So that's what we're getting into. Moving the glycol chiller. Chiller's moved, piped in on the vacuum pump. Got to finish insulating. And then it sits right here now, short line set. And we'll let the vacuum pump run overnight and then we'll get it all adjusted hopefully tomorrow. Oh, yeah, back inside the walk in. Look at that. Let's get high. Now those are hops for making beer. So what you see here is, <clears throat> this is the organic brewery, so everything's recycled. And we recycled the insulation in the pipe in the last install, the Unistrat, the clamps. And I took a, uh, heated up the pipe, took a conduit bender, and bent a little offset in there. And that's what you see right there. Kind of funky, but works. And this is the same condensing unit that was up in the sky. Now it's down on the ground. And we'll let that vacuum pump run overnight. They're gonna hook the pumps up for it. And tomorrow we'll uh, get it up and running and we'll, we'll adjust the expansion valves and whatnot. And, See if we can get between 8 and 10 degrees superheat on that thing. There it is. But this this was a second-hand unit and it's been working great for them, so it's kind of cool to see things reused. <laughs> 